Good morning, my Dantes. How are you all doing today? Update oh, from yesterday. We were all asked to leave. Well, not really leave, cause they didn't know. They don't know when the flight is gonna be ready. So what we did is we left our name, a number, and they said when the flight is ready, they'll call us. I hope they call us, cause I don't want to miss my flight. That experience is the worst experience of my life. So I had to call. Uh, Gary's nephew contacted Gary so Gary's sister and cousin that's in the city came to pick me yesterday so I, I came to their house in the city so I'm actually in the city now not in the countryside it's a big house with like six bedrooms and they've been taking good care of me I've been been treated like a queen on this life I believe the country life now I'm living the city life you know it's, it's different it's kind of from this is the room that I'm in right now See my luggage over there. My boxes in my bag over there. The, um, the crew member of the plane, they were so unprofessional. The customer service was shit. Everything about the the airport experience, airport experience, airline experience, plane, crew was shitty. Mm -mm. What if I had nobody here? What if I have? What if I came here for forget? Oh, and for people that had nobody here to call. They gave them vouchers for hotels to stay in. So if I didn't have nobody yet, they probably would give me vouchers for hotels to stay in. But what about food? What about all the things? I'm just so blessed to have people here, honestly. I'm sitting in Jamaica, yo. I should be in Canada by now. That's what it is. I'm gonna make the best of it. There's always something positive out of the negative, you know? Whatever situation you're going through, actually what, what will determine how the extent of how would I say now? What would determine if the situation is really bad is your attitude. Like, whatever you're going through, don't let it bring you down. We could, I could have been crying or throwing myself on the floor and be like, Why me? Why me? You did try me. Give a positive attitude wherever it goes. You see that the, whatever you're going through is actually not that bad. But things happen in life. Just but if it's out of your reach, is if it's out of your power, honey, just keep a positive attitude one step at a time keep living life don't let anyone tell you any different people who want to control your life too don't give them the chance to it's your life don't do it alone though with god he will definitely help you and i thank god i have god in my life because if not i don't know but i know he's with me and i know my relationship with him whatever other people say doesn't matter you're the one who knows yourself you're the one who knows your relationship between god other people don't matter you hear me well it's night so i called them um, canada air canada and guess what they said the plane actually left at 1 p.m today and they can't get me on any flights tomorrow so i have to wait till thursday so i'm spending three extra days more in in, in jamaica my flight is gonna be at 4 24 p.m on thursday so tomorrow I, I was really pissed i was really pissed i didn't have no compensation no nothing when I get back to Canada, I'm going to call Air Canada and complain to them because this is definitely ridiculous because I've been in all day today. I edited a video. It's um actually important right now. It's 47%. And while that import or whatever I export or whatever I'm watching um, vlogs by DK at 4L. The muscles, do you guys watch them as well? As well? I think they're a really cute couple. Good morning! Um, Gary is coming soon to get me, so we're going up the hill, the countryside again. We're going to the river today to be in the water because it's just a perfect day to be in the river because it's really, really hot. I'm wearing my, um, what is it called? Kente inspired swimwear. Hey guys, Gary is here to pick me back to the countryside. It's hot! Okay? I don't think I want to come to Jamaica during the summer no more. It has to be during winter, man. This is it's super duper hot. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna spend all day in the freaking water. That's how hot it is. Like Guys, we're back to the river now. We're back up the hill again. It already feels so cool here, eh? Compared to the city, the city was super duper hot. Like I thought I was gonna die. What you say? <laughs> is it cold? <laughs> Time to go and get mango? Yeah. River to Canada with me, please. <laughs> Whoa! Look, look.
look, look. <laughs> look, 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 look. goats now they were one there before yeah. oh see mango yeah, yeah. see over there too yeah there's one over there too there's one of you're gonna go up there that yeah. looks scary that, see that's the thing i don't like about country team be eating me alive oh no we lost both of it so what are you climbing for then oh, get wow. down look at this guy look at this look at this this tarzan guy oh look at that he's sure ripe Woo! this guy got skills Oh my god, don't go there, please. It looks like really like not so slanty on camera, but it's so slanty. Ah! Don't, don't go, please. Oh my god, this guy is gonna kill me. Jesus. Like it's so slanty, guys. You don't understand. Like it's like a freaking ditch down there. Look at the pigs, yo. You see how the baby, baby they grow? Look. Yeah. Like, the look. Baby. Oh, look at it. just gave birth to more babies. No, remember when we came here the first day, they just had babies? Yeah. Those, those oh, they're like growing up now. Yeah. And those are all the babies she had before? Yeah. Oh my gosh. That's the mother and that's the father. This is fun. See how this guy just catches mango. It's black mango. See that? Mm, interesting. Look at how many we've already had already. And that is like after losing that two, eh? Gary, let it go. Gary, let... Oh my god. This guy is jumping on the freaking edge. It's too far. Let it go, man. Where is that? An apple, apple tree? Yeah. What? Yeah. This? Yeah, the one with the dry sprang. Wait, have not I seen an apple tree before? Oh. So there's no apple on it right now, though? No, no. That's apparently that's an apple tree. What, what is this? It's weed. <laughs> <laughs> See, weed, bro. I'm going to get high after. Yeah. No, I'm not. I'm kidding, mother. I'm not getting high. Gary's getting high, though. He's a bad child. No, I'm kidding. It doesn't smoke. Nobody, none of us smoke. Like you smoke it like this? The dry ones? No, like here. Mm hmm Like this, this piece here. The bud. Right yeah. Here. Yeah. Oh, that's what you smoke? Yeah. That's what people sell? Yeah. So what about the leaves? But I see them with a lot of leaves. Yeah, some of the, the leaves like up here, they use like, they smoke with these. Like. Yeah. But like if you, you could boil tea with this. Oh, uh, really? With the weed? Yeah, because yeah, weed is supposed to be medicin yeah. medicin medicinal anyway. Smell. Oh, that's really weed. <laughs> it really smells like weed, yo. No, but this one, the leaves doesn't really smell. What did you give me to smell just now? Because I touched the bud. The, oh, the, the, that's the, why. Because the, the leaf doesn't really smell. No, over there. Yeah, I know plantain. Green plantain. What are those? Those are pear. Oh, but they're not ripe yet. No. He got it from the bush. Yeah. What? That's a lot of pear. Yeah. I wish they were ripe because I like pear with yeah. salt. Yeah. No, the ones that I saw in the country from uh, your cousin's house, yeah. oh my god, it was like twice that, eh? But they call it pure here, we call it avocado oh, okay. in Canada. I'm not saying they're ripe. Yeah, one. none of them are ripe yet. You can basically live here and survive and not go to the city. Yeah. Jeez, this place, man. It's like, it's just, I don't know, it just does something to me. Okay. I think it's the you hills. The blue, mount, the blue mountain? The blue, yeah, they call that blue mountain, eh? Over there. And this thing is like zoomed like crazy anyway. You see people do go there sometimes? Yeah, yeah like tourists go there too. Are you serious? Yeah, like so why they, didn't you take me there? They go there for the weekend. Oh, okay. is it like a resort or something? Yeah, but it's really? Like, yeah, people go there to see the sun set in the morning. Oh. When the sun comes, like when you're up there, you're like up, up, way up. Are you so you serious? can see when you come out of the, out of the, the Why street? didn't you take me there? It's too far, man. You can't do too much walking. Oh, you have to walk all yeah. the way down you, there? Oh, can, hell no. You can really cold up there too. The cold. cold? Yeah, it will cold. because it's like yeah. way, way high there. This place, man, it's just, I don't know, just peaceful and pretty. And this guy won't let me carry anything. Bags, whatever, he carries everything. He won't let me touch a thing. But like, why? Spoiling me. What? The way he catches it, man. Found more mangoes. This is mango that we pay like so expensive in Canada with it. Eh? We're just plugging on the tree now. Here. It's good to be tall, eh? If we weren't tall, I won't be your friend. <laughs> okay. Okay, mama. <laughs> this guy leaves his bathroom. He has a bathroom in his house. He leaves the bathroom and goes showers in the freaking bush. Yeah. Where did they do that? How do how you grow up in the bush and then come act like a city boy in London, Ontario? Oh, not that soft. This one. Well, this one is really soft. Right. Okay. Thank you for the pear. Hey, my dentees. I'm leaving again. Hopefully, this time is I'm actually leaving. Fingers crossed. Maybe I'll get home today. I hope I get home. Okay, nice to meet you, Sean. Uh -huh. What? 
I forget the counter time too, so he is with the and get to know him one better. No, you can't know me better. I'm Gary's girlfriend. Oh? Gary, the guy driving? Yeah, what guy? Yeah. Huh? Take care, okay? No problem. Ooh. I'm riding behind the truck with my guys. It's crazy! It's actually not as bad as I thought. I was sitting behind me. He was like he was trying to get to know me. Hi. And like, can he get my number or whatever? I'm like, I'm Gary's friend, girlfriend. He's like, oh, okay. <laughs> so all this eyes on me now. Yeah, come on. See ya. I'm just sliding off. <laughs> I keep sliding off the thing. <laughs> this is fun. It's mountains, guys. It's so pretty here. 5,000 Jamaican dollars, eh? So you have two of this, you have $10,000? What? Okay guys, this is the second Dubai. Hopefully this is actually Dubai. And I don't get to stay again. Because I've been made of somebody. Not me. Well, not you. Say bye to them because this is the last time we're seeing this. Peace out, and I will be in Jamaica for a little bit more. So, yeah, he's here for one more week. Hopefully, I actually get to Canada today, guys. Pray for me. Hey guys, the airplane now. I'm actually going home this time. It's not delayed, it's not cancelled. And I'll tell you what they said about the Monday flight. They actually said they flew the next day. I'm the only person that wasn't on that plane. So my stay was extended for free for two more days. For free. Because usually if I was going to extend it for, for two more days or whatever, you have to pay like extra. So I'm in the airplane now. The airplane with the moving, the electricity is working, everything is fine, AC is on. Thank God. That's what's popping. So I guess I'll see you guys when I get to Canada. Alright? I'm so happy I'm going home, guys. I had so much fun in Jamaica, but man, I'm so happy to be home. There's no place like home. Hey guys, I know it's so loud, I'm not sure you can hear me. The time now is 5.15. So we boarded, we, the plane moved like around 4, I think 4.30. So I'm quarter to 5. So we're actually in the air right now. We're actually moving. So thank God. So right now I'm just basically like going to the pictures. Lots of lots of pictures. And also because I bought some food, I bought some like curry, curry go with rice and peas because I really wanted to have the last piece of Jamaican food before I left, you know? So that's what I'm eating right now. 
lacking. Your girl is back. I've been back since 2 a.m. today. So now I'm home. Since I go home, I unpacked, trying to do laundry. As you can see over there. I like this new phone already. So I got the Sony Xperia. This phone is big as hell. I went to get a new phone. And I went to get my package that came in from Fashion Nova. And I cleaned a little bit, as you can see, the place is not as messy as much. Bro brought back some Jamaican money. What I travel to now, I want to save the money. Like about 2,000 Jamaican, this is 1,000 Jamaican, so I bought two of that. And it is about $20. And I brought some coins too. The next one I'm going to, I'm planning to, I'm planning to go to Nigeria very soon because I've not been to Nigeria in 10 years. And actually, I've gone to Nigeria for, to see my family, but going to Nigeria is so expensive. But going to Jamaica, actually, I spent less than a thousand dollars. Don't even understand, like less. Planning to go to Nigeria early next year, by the great special grace of God. So that I'm gonna work. I'm gonna have to work hard and save. And also, uh, besides my Fashion Nova box that came in, my lot of Zafu swimwear over there. Cause I bought some two piece before I left. But it came in the day that I was leaving. Actually, I think a day before I left. So another Zafu two-piece bikini haul is coming. Like, it's gonna be late. A lot of videos that are coming is gonna be late. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm gonna end it here. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoy. And remember, life is what you make it, okay? Don't let nobody spoil your joy. Don't let nobody protect your energy. Don't let nobody, like, kill your vibes. You hear me? Be happy, okay? God is good. And remember Jesus. He loves you. All right? Thank you. Love you. Bye.